Tory MPs plotting to replace Sunak with Penny Mordaunt before general election. Reports of an attempt to oust the Prime Minister before the general election came as controversies piled up around him. Kate Middleton to address public overhealth concerns. Princess of Wales Kate Middleton, who has been absent from public appearances since January, is expected to address her concerns at a public event, a new report claimed. Flying taxis could launch in two years in UK skies. The Department of Transport says the plans for flying taxis will turn science fiction into reality. M25 in Surrey reopens eight hours ahead of schedule. The five-mile stretch of the motorway between junctions 10 and 11 was closed in both directions at 9 p.m. on Friday. Defense Secretary Grant Shapps abandons Ukrainian port visit over Russian missile threat. The defense secretary was reportedly warned by British intelligence that the Kremlin was aware of his travel plans during a visit to the war-torn country last week. The U.S. president has met Northern Ireland's first and deputy first ministers at the White House. Two arrested after man killed, trying to stop car being stolen, police say. Greater Manchester Police, GMP, were called to reports of an unresponsive male on Olympic Street, Beswick, at just before 11 a.m. on Saturday. St. Patrick's Day celebrated by parades in Ireland and beyond. Vibrant pictures from the likes of London, Belfast and Chicago showed thousands of people come together to celebrate. SNP's longest-serving MP Pete Wishart will not use Tory-free party message in general election campaign. First Minister Hamza Yousaf used the phrase Tory-free multiple times at the SNP's campaign conference in Perth on Saturday.